Welcome back to another episode of the Hermit Poetry Series. I'm Neil Eakin, and on this channel I read poetry, mostly work by contemporary poets, occasionally poems of my own, and once in a while poems from the past. Today's poem comes to us from Matthew Oldsman from his collection Mezzanines, published by Alice James Books in 2013. This was the winner of the 2011 Kundiman Prize for Poetry. Um, the poem I'm going to read is midway through the collection and entitled the man who looks lost as he stands in the sympathy card section of Hallmark. The man who looks lost as he stands in the sympathy card section of Hallmark looks so sad with his bent umbrella that you want to place a hand on his shoulder say, it'll be okay, but you don't, because you also look like a crumbling st statue narrowed by rain, because you too have been abandoned by language, and what's there to speak of? or write among so many words. There are not enough words to say, someone is gone, and in their place is a blue sound that only fits inside an urn, which you'll drag to the mountains or empty in an ocean, with the hope that the tide will deliver a message that you never could. Because even those words will end like a shipwreck at the bottom of clear water. Someone will, would eventually look down, notice the shattered hull, the mast snapped in half, and believe those words meant ruin, when they really meant starfish, iceberg, or scar tissue. And even those words would fail. In this room that smells like lemon candle wax and wild berry poopourri, you pick up a card, set it down again, pick up a card, toss it aside. In leaving, you take only an empty envelope, or... You are an empty envelope, or you're the boat searching for the glacier to gouge its side again. You're the door that opens to the sleet outside. You're the bell that bangs above the door as the door slams shut. That was Matthew Oldsman from Mezzanines, the man who looks lost as he stands in the sympathy card section of Hallmark, Alice James Books, 2013. Uh, winner of the Kundiman Prize, uh, Poetry Prize in 2011. If you enjoyed this reading and this poem, please do check out the description of the video for more information about uh, Matthew Oldsman and more information, a link actually back to the, the press to purchase a copy of the book, and more information about other projects and series that I'm currently working on. Um, I hope that, uh, that these readings are connecting with you and uh, that you're finding joy. Uh, wonder, interest in the poems that I'm selecting. If you have suggestions yourself, uh, please do make comments below. Let me know if there are poets or poems that you would like to see featured on this series. I'm always open for suggestions. I do my best to track the books down and when possible, try to find a way to feature them in the series. Um, I'm thankful for uh, each of you, uh, among you, uh, the brand new view viewers that have been joining us over the last few weeks, those of you who have been around from the beginning. Uh, grateful for spring, although <laughs> really right now outside we have a bit of a snowfall, even though we're supposed to be done with it. Um, but I am grateful for spring. We will get there soon. And grateful for opportunities to, to be out in the world, to be engaged in the world. Grateful for opportunities to interact with others and thankful for all of you through the means of technology uh, that are able to be part of this great experiment and project of uh, reading through and celebrating the work of these wonderful contemporary poets. Um, I hope that as you share these links and comment below, subscribe to the channel or hit the thumbs up to like these videos, in some small way that expands the the reach of these videos encourages more people to discover contemporary poetry and hopefully even write and create on their own so wherever you are in the world and whatever you're about i hope you're having a great time um, as we enter into another week and wish you all the best in your own creative journeys we'll be back again soon with more poetry and more reading i'm neil aiken this is the hermit poetry series and we'll be back uh, in a couple days uh, with another great poet and another great poem. And so until then, stay safe and well. We'll see you soon. Bye.